and chilling it is and very scary. Now Chesterfield Township Police are trying to find out if any suspects were caught on surveillance video. She knew something was wrong and that she needed to get us to a hospital. Friends Kim Rundle and Whitney Gossick fear what could have happened if their friend Jamie had not been their designated driver Friday night. I was the DD, um, which we were both we're all very thankful for because, you know, I was the one that wasn't drinking. That's because when the three friends went to a bar in Chesterfield Township, it appears Kim and Whitney were drugged when someone slipped something into their beers. And they think it was a trio of mystery women who asked them to save their space and they would get them all something to drink. We didn't think anything of it just because we're at a show with all girls and what's there to think about. About 20 minutes after we drank about half of the beer, maybe 20, 30 minutes, we really don't remember much of what happened after that. Kim and Whitney started to feel sick, and Jamie first noticed something was wrong with Whitney. She could barely stand up straight, and you know, I just I noticed that that's something that I've never seen before. She gave Whitney some water and took her to get some air. I took her outside, went back in to get Kim, which is when I noticed that Kim wasn't acting very right either, and um, you know, just it was it was just very scary. Both Whitney and Kim suddenly felt sick and high at the same time. Like I was starting to black out and kind of feel sick to my stomach. I, I felt like I was high, like I was on some major drugs. And when Whitney was outside alone, she vaguely remembers a chilling moment when one of the women who got them those beers tried to get her to go with them. One putting their arm around me, telling me that I had been drugged, that I needed to go to the hospital and to go with her. Jamie rushed her friends to the hospital. Chesterfield Township Police are now investigating. Thankfully, Kim and Whitney are okay, but they want to warn others to not accept a drink from anyone, especially after they say one of their relatives, who is a police officer, told them what sex traffickers may have been up to. They send in girls to befriend other females because who wouldn't trust another female? They go and buy them drinks and they get you to wherever they want to take you, other than the hospital. Don't trust anybody that you don't know and even women. And Chesterfield Township Police say the women's blood work is being analyzed and their investigation continues. Reporting live, Kimberly Craig, 7 Action News. Wow, what a scary one there, Kim. Thank goodness that one girl wasn't drinking. Well, we are